can chasing this. So too is Sean Newton, who's come away with it. Harewood. Repka advancing, and Zamora trying to flick, and in comes Etherington. And he sent it straight back across to Sorensen. It's a terrific chance. A little step over at the front post, and Villa all over the place. Davis. Milner. Now Samuel. This is promising from Aston Villa. That's a good cross. And it's been put in. Aston Villa lead. Andre claiming a part in it. It's a terrific little reverse ball from Milner to get Samuel down the outside. There, Afton needs a good ball in. And you couldn't ask for a better front post cross than that. Henry had made his run from right to the front post, but he couldn't have asked for a better ball. Konczewski is the man to deliver. Zamora! Cracking header from Bobby Zamora. He is the scorer. And the Hammers hit back. It's a wonderful ball in. But there's nobody picking up the run. Johnson can't come for that, too much pace on it, bending away from him, and it's a simple finish. Samuel. It's a decent delivery, and he's there again, Lee Hendry, and Roy Carroll held on that time. Hendry's done well when the ball's on the left-hand side. He's become more or less the third striker for Villa. But it's a nice height for Carroll. Etherington takes. Gabidon is there. What a big chance. Handball shout. As Mullins struck it, and it's given. It's a penalty. Well, Delaney's just thrown himself to try and make the block. Here comes Hayward. It is a cracking penalty. And the man who scored a hat-trick against Villa earlier in the season has got trouble in store for them again. West Ham have turned it around. Oh, it certainly is a cracking penalty. I think even if Sorensen goes the right way here, he doesn't get this. 